We have created a short educational video on the rotary sorter. The rotary sorter is available in one core, two core, and four core modular units. We'd be happy to answer any questions you may have after viewing this video. Thank you. Hi everyone, my name is Sherry and I work for Profile Industries. Today we're going to have an opportunity to go over the rotary sorter with you. The rotary sorter is capable of cleaning soybeans from debris and splits as well as other commodities. So right now we're going to head to the top of the machine and take a look at the orifice plates. Now that we're at the top of the rotary sorter, we want to take this opportunity to go over three different sized orifice plates. These three orifice plates are recommended for soybeans. The first one is a 1.875. The 1.875 is for large to extra large soybeans with splits and debris. If that seems to be too large for the particular soybeans you're running, you can move to a 1.750. That would be to a medium to large soybean with debris and splits as well. If that orifice plate inner dimension is still too large, you can go to a 1.625. The 1.625 would be small to medium soybeans with debris and splits. The feeder system located in the center of the rotary sorter's top is what controls the flow. The flow at this point in time is a 1.875. This is easily changed into a smaller orifice plate by simply setting it on top of the machine. The next item that I wanna take a look at is our dust collection system. These ports are located on every machine. They can handle up to 1500 CFM. If you don't have a current dust collection system in place, it's not a problem. You just simply go up and place the cap over the port and you're all set. Another function of the rotary sorter is the two large viewing windows, one in the front of the machine and one in the rear of the machine. Not only does that give you access to cleaning the machine as well as maintaining the machine, but you also get to see your product running at the same time. Now I'm gonna go ahead and remove our large viewing window. Let's take a peek inside the rotary sorter. One item that you won't be able to see in this video is our belt drive system that sits above the rotating core. As we go down, you'll see that the rotating core in this particular situation for soybeans is an eight inch core. Now I'm gonna go ahead and put the viewing window back on because we will be rotating the core. Now that we've taken a look inside the rotary sorter, I'd like to be able to point out the technology behind the rotary sorter. Our VFD drive system is simple to operate, effective, and extremely efficient when it comes to sorting your commodities. A little bit about the VFD drive is as you can see here, you have run and stop, forward and reverse, and you also have a turn dial. This turn dial will actually rotate the core while rotating the core the very precise digital monitor tells you exactly what rpms you are running the commodity at as you can see the adjustments on it are very simple now that we've taken a look at the VFV drive we want to go under the machine and show you where the good round seed comes out and where the discharge. This hole here is where the good round seed will discharge from the machine. And this is where the non-round or poor material will discharge from the machine. We are proud to say that our machine, the rotary sorter, comes in one core, two core, and four core options. All completely modular to fit your particular processing line. At 30 RPM and 1.625 orifice plate, the results were because of the slower feed rate, we were able to capture more round seed. From the 30 RPM setting, we moved down to a 15 RPM setting, still using the 1.625. The difference between the 30 RPM and the 15 RPM has to do with the centrifugal force that the rotary was creating. 
Now we're going to move on to a larger orifice plate at 1.875 at 30 RPM. By keeping the 1.875 orifice plate, we ran it at 15 RPM. As you may have noticed, sample number four was the least successful, and that had to do with the larger orifice plate and the slower speed rate. We wanted to take this opportunity to show you from field to field or from year to year. Soybean separation can be very difficult. The rotary sorter has the flexibility to take care of that issue.